Good afternoon, planner friends. It is already past breakfast time. Kind of getting a late start today. Um, ignore the beautiful hair. It is bedhead for sure. So I'm just kind of hanging out here getting some household chores done. Um, we will be going out to dinner tonight um, to one of the restaurants that we have kind of felt comfortable eating that since the shutdown happened and some of the restrictions have been lifted here. Um, we do feel comfortable at this restaurant, so it's one of our favorite places. We will be going to eat there this evening, but for now I'm trying to get some chores done and we may have a game night tonight as well. Um, Thank you all again for the kind comments from yesterday. I hope you got some helpful tips. Um, I hope to be bringing some more content to you that is planner related during Vlogmas. Just probably not a whole lot of it. I may be sharing a couple of recipes in the next few weeks. I have not been cooking quite as much um, because it seems like stuff has not slowed down since Thanksgiving. We were supposed to go to a friend's house tomorrow evening to celebrate Christmas with them, but we have changed our plans with that, unfortunately. So this is probably going to be a more low-key weekend. We do have some Christmas lights that need to be finished up outside the house, and a few more finishing touches inside the house before I feel like it is completely decorated. So. It will be kind of a low-key vlogmas the next few days, but I still hope that you guys enjoy. So I'm going to go get some chores done, and then I'm going to probably get a shower and get this mess tamed down a little bit. It did look pretty until I got a hold of it. So I'm going to get a shower, get ready for dinner tonight, and then when we come home, I'll probably let you guys in on some game night activities if that's what we choose to do. So I will catch up with you guys later. So how many of you have elves that come back every December? We have two. This is Snowflake and this is Buddy. And this was not Mama Elf approved, but this was winter and I cannot remember the other one's name. Emma named them. And this is what they did last night. Pretty cute, but they are here and they get into lots of mischief. So you may see them pop up every every once in a while during Vlogmas. It's time for dinner. So we are back home from dinner and it was delicious. I got five boneless wings in a honey hot sauce and crinkle fries and their ranch is absolutely to die for. I'm getting ready to change clothes and get comfortable, and we may play some games in a little while. So if we do, I will check back in with you then. All right, so we're in some comfy clothes now. Hubby and I are getting ready to check out the newest episode of The Mandalorian, and then I believe it will be game night. All right, so first game of the night, it is called Castles. We were taught this game by our friends. And it's really fun. Not too hard to learn. Um, 
if you look online for the rules of the game, Palace is the same, pretty much the same rules, and it requires two decks of cards, so just be aware of that if you decide that you like the game, but we're playing Castles right now. Alright, the next game we're playing is called Timeline, and there are several different versions. We're doing the Inventions set. So what you have to do is you get six of these little playing cards, and you'll start with one card in the middle, and you have to decide whether your event on your card comes before or after the one in the middle, and you got to place it right. Pretty fun. There's all different kinds of categories you can buy, but this one, again, is the Inventions. Like this. All right, so the next game is Checkers. I'm going to watch my daughter and my husband play. Unbelievably, I do not know how to play checkers, so hopefully I can learn this, but next game is checkers. Alright, so we're wrapping up game night. Um, daughter and Ubby are still playing checkers. I did try and lost, but I gave it my best shot, so let me show you a couple more game ideas, and the reason I thought I'd share game night tonight what we love to do on New Year's Eve is play some games and have snack foods. So this may be something you can think about doing this year for your New Year's Eve celebration. If you have tweens or teens, this game is really fun. Um, even like the 10 to 12 year old range could pick the, this game up pretty easily. It's the Haunted Mansion it's Call of the Spirits game by Funko. And it is a really fun board game you have objectives and things that you can do in certain places of the haunted mansion and it's a really fun game we're also trying to learn this one a little better this is a new game to us it's called villainous um you become a disney villain and there's certain things you have to do um we are still in the learning process for this one like i said there are expansion packs for this one, but from what we've played, this is actually another fun game. And a couple more suggestions. Sushi Go is an awesome game. Uh, we played this last New Year's Eve for the first time and love it. We pick it up and play it all the time. And Quix, which is a dice game. Um, it's really fun. We were able to find both of these at Target. Villainous is available at Target. The Haunted Mansion you would probably have to get like at Barnes & Noble or Amazon, somewhere like that. These are the timeline games you saw us playing earlier. We played the Invention version. This is also American History that we have. And Americana, and there are several other versions of this game. Alright, so that's it for today's Vlogmas. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Hope you enjoyed a little me time, and have a great night. Bye. Alright, the next game we're playing is <coughs> Timeline. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, so that's it for tonight's... Alright, so that's it for... Alright, so that's it for today's Vlogmas. <laughs>